Welcome to this ancient desert battlefield. Here, we will reveal a fundamental yet powerful concept in physics, elasticity. Elasticity is a special kind of force. It originates from the elastic deformation of objects. Today, we will explore the mysteries of elasticity through this battle. Look at this bow. When I pull the bowstring tight, the bow's bending is a manifestation of elasticity. Elasticity is the force generated by an object's elastic deformation. It is this force that allows the arrow to be shot. <laughs> the ordinary bow and arrow used just now, due to insufficient elasticity, had a limited range. Now, let's try a fire arrow for greater deformation. Observe the effect of the shot. When the bowstring is pulled tighter, creating more deformation, the elasticity is stronger. That's why this time we can shoot farther and hit the target. The magnitude of elasticity is directly related to the extent of deformation. Look over there, enemy cavalry is preparing to charge. In the upcoming confrontation, we will continue to observe the role of elasticity. Notice our crossbowmen. Compared to bows, crossbows have a different design. This also affects their usage. Crossbows use mechanical devices to lock and release the string. Although this results in a relatively shorter range, it provides greater stability and accuracy. This design allows soldiers to shoot more precisely in close-range combat. Especially effective in defense. This demonstrates the unique application of elasticity in different weapon designs. Highlighting the applicability and diversity of physical principles in real situations. Look, as our crossbowmen bravely counterattack. The enemy's chariots are surging forward. Signaling the intense confrontation in the next battle scene. Next, let us witness this clash of strength and strategy. Now look at these ballistas. They are designed similarly to bows and arrows, but on a larger scale and with greater force. The ballista's elastic ropes are stretched to the limit, demonstrating the elasticity within the material's limits. When these elastic ropes reach their limit, they can unleash tremendous force. As this spectacular battle concludes, we've felt the importance of elasticity in the art of war. It's not just a branch of physics, but also a vital part of history and culture. Students suppose you are Mosey, an extraordinary weapons expert from ancient times, facing a new challenge. Design a new type of bow and arrow capable of launching arrows over long distances on the battlefield. Based on the principles of elasticity, how do you think this bow and arrow should be designed to achieve the best range? And explain your answer. A. Choose a harder material for the bow to increase its elasticity. B. Use a longer bow to increase the stretch length of the bowstring. C. Increase the length of the bowstring to enhance the elasticity of the bow and arrow. D. Use composite materials to make the bow, improving its toughness and power output. E. Improve the design of the arrows, for example, by increasing the stability of the tail, to enhance range and accuracy. F. Design heavier arrows to increase their momentum when launched. There's a famous saying in China, the victor becomes the king, the defeated become bandits. On this historical battlefield, if your answer is correct, you will be crowned as the overlord, commanding control over the city. However, if your answer is wrong, the city will fall, and you will be sent to the gallows. This is not only a test of your knowledge in physics but also a challenge to your decision-making and strategic abilities. Let us enter this contest of knowledge and wisdom together and see who can emerge as the true winner on this historical battlefield. <laughs>